<laughs> Yo, a little over one year ago, I made my first ever video, which was solving 2000 Rubik's Cubes in one city. Fast forward one year, I want to do something more challenging because let's face it, I didn't die. And I'm pretty bored sitting inside. So I moved my coffee machine next to me. I got a bunch of SD cards and finally this Rubik's Cube. I'm going to attempt to solve this Rubik's Cube for 24 hours straight. Is that a total waste of time? Definitely. Yeah, let, let's just do it. While this guy is solving his first Rubik's Cube, let me show you how this works. If you look very closely, you can see that I'm using this website, which gives you a Rubik's Cube scramble. I apply that scramble to my Rubik's Cube, which gives it a very unique state. Then I solve that scramble. This is totally not sped up. And when I stop the timer, a new scramble shows up. And then the whole story repeats itself for 24 hours. Off to a pretty good start. Alright, so we're one hour in. I lied, it is one hour and one minute. So far, I have done 122 souls, which is not that many. It is very easy right now. I, I do this all the time, like practice sessions of one hour. Ooh! Woo! 684. Oh, I'm such an idiot. So I was changing the batteries of my camera because it was empty. I just did a few more souls without filming and bam. I'm never going to break this solve <laughs> and I'm so pissed. So we're three hours in and I start to notice that my times are getting so much worse. You see that here, it's going up. We're a bit over 400 souls right now. And that kind of makes me wonder like how many souls will we have at the end of the 24 hours, you know? Hey Phil, how's it going? Hey, I'm not bad. How about you? You might be wondering, why would I call the CEO of a cube shop? Hmm, can I do a giveaway? Sure, of course. Uh, does 50 bucks sound good? Yeah, perfect. Thanks. Do you want to join? Sure. Okay, so all you have to do is guess how many souls I will have at the end of the 24-hour session. So thanks to this beautiful man right here, we can do a $50 giveaway to thecubicle.com. All you need to do is guess how many souls I will have done at the end of the 24-hour session. And guess the time of the 69 souls in case someone else guesses the same amount as you. Oh, and while we're at it, just quickly like and subscribe. Thank you so much. I'll say 4,500. You want to say right. something to the video? Yeah, sure. For a lot of people who are curious, doing a 24-hour cube marathon is actually extremely difficult. Definitely respect the cube head for uh, doing it. I think the most difficult thing will definitely be just, you know, staying awake. I mean, you could just fall asleep at the table. Like, if you just lost control of your body entirely, you just fall asleep. Oh. And I think that would actually be pretty funny if that was on video, too. Either way, you're gonna have a good video. Alright, thanks a lot. See you, man. Philly's such a cool guy, for real. We're five hours in, I've done around 700 souls. It's getting pretty difficult right now. Like, I just wanna get some air, but I'm not taking a break because I'm not weak. However, I can do this. I just dropped my most expensive cube, but I think it's fine. <laughs> so there weren't any benches free, so I'm just going to sit here in the grass. Pretty cozy, right? There's a bench free, guys. Do you hear these ducks? Let's go back inside because it's getting dark right now and my hands are freezing. Alright, a little over six hours right now. We're in one quarter of the challenge. Jesus, we still have so long to go. Look what they just delivered. This has to be the best moment of the day so far. This is great. Alright, 1,000 souls, 
my times are getting pretty bad right now. So I just discovered that 1000 souls is the max amount of souls I can enjoy because I'm not having fun anymore. <laughs> Alright, we're one third in the way. And gosh, look at my eyes. It feels like I've been doing this for like 20 hours, but it's only one third. It's time for my first coffee. That's pretty cool having a coffee machine over there. Ah, oh, that's way too warm. I'm changing tactics a bit because I was thinking, you know, I'm sitting on the desk just solving and it was pretty boring. So I thought, you know, I'm just gonna put on my headset, gonna sit in the sofa, watch a movie. Ah, uh, you know, enjoy things a bit. Woo! <laughs> I'm so going to fall asleep here, but. So we're at thir thir 13, I cannot speak English, what is this? 13 hours right now and uh, look, I've done 1672 souls. My times are getting pretty average actually. I think it's the coffee that gave me a little boost. From now on though, I will not share anymore the amount of souls I have done because you have to guess them in the comments for the giveaway. Hey, what are you doing here? I'm not cheating, okay? I'm cubing, see? I'm tired. I just had a last layer skip. If you don't know what I'm talking about, the chances of getting a last layer skip are 1 in 15,000. And I just got that. And that also explains the look on my face. We are 16 hours in, which is good. Because that's two thirds of the way. The crazy thing is that my hands don't hurt yet. Which amazes me, because I was worried that my hands would fall off, but... They still work. <laughs> 17 and a half hours in and, you know, I cannot think straight anymore. I really need something to wake me up because... Did you see that? CS timer was crashing. That's 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 not okay. I changed my mind. The plans are not working. Oh. guys think of my t-shirt it's, it's like Nike but nice <laughs> I just want to get this clock and throw it on the ground and my hands do hurt right now like I can I cannot move my hands anymore I'm having fun guys this is so much fun guys I think the Sun is starting to set I mean rise I mean, the sun is going up. Let's go outside. Mm. It's pretty noisy out here, but I've got my cube and my laptop. Hey. <laughs> Someone was waving at me. Gym and gloves. We only have one more hour to go and that makes me crazy happy. I'm going to give this last hour my all. I'm just going to try to get as many souls done as I can in one hour. Yes! 
I didn't do it for zero hours though. I did it for 24 hours. Woo! Okay, that was super lame, but man, I'm so, so glad that I can't go to bed. But let's first talk a bit about this. So here's a graph of all the souls I did. And I have to say that until here, I guess around here, I was still enjoying it. And then I, I just, I gradually got worse, but because, you know, it's really difficult to see, but I think my average at the end was like 11 and a half. In the beginning it was like nine, very low nine here. Like this entire part, I just turned off my brain and I, I kept solving because I didn't have a choice. And I think the, the most difficult thing about, like you wanna sleep, but at the same time you have to use your brain. And at the same time you have to move your fingers all the time. My hands are like, can you see this? I don't know if it catches on camera, but I have like, just like skin coming off my fingers. It's, I'm so glad that I finished this. Like, this is the biggest achievement of my life, guys. I have like more than 250 gigs of video files, which is, I'm not looking forward to this, but I'm so glad that this is over. I did this for you guys. I'm going to bed. Never do this. This is a bad idea. Ciao. What if I filmed the entire thing like this? <laughs>